Mr. Hopkins, you may agree with them, thinking, yes, we should simply study our Mr. Pritchard and learn our rhyme and meter and go quietly about the business of achieving other ambitions. I have a little secret for you. Huddle up. Huddle up! Hey, we are the Photobus Society. We are all photography students and most of our days look like this. But a few years ago, Christoph applied for a professorship and changed everything. What the hell is going on here? So we asked him to introduce himself. At the beginning, it was a little bit difficult. My name is Christoph Bangert and I'm a photographer. <laughs> I used to work uh, in war zones and disaster areas, blah, blah, blah. Fuck, fuck, this is so difficult. So we decided to try it by ourselves. This is Christoph Bangard. He's a photojournalist. He spent 10 years covering wars and disaster for the New York Times. Christoph grew up racing. He has perfect control on any vehicle he drives. Well, at least most of the time. And he published a book called I don't want to talk about war porn anymore. <laughs> so I won awards, I was very successful. The New York Times published my pictures. It was great, it was, felt really, really meaningful. But at the same time, I sent my family through hell. Also fucked up myself by doing this work. And I started teaching and I really, really enjoyed teaching. It was my savior in a way to start teaching. We went to Berlin, we went to Perpignan, we went to these places with my Land Rover, but then the Land Rover became much too small and it was always full of people who wanted to come. And then I thought, we need a bus. I did not want to be just another boring photography teacher. I wanted to teach in a completely new and different way. I wanted to teach in a non-conventional way. Photography is a medium that is not necessarily best taught in a classroom. You have to go out and see the world and interact with real people in order to learn photography. You have to practice, you have to get better, you have to live life in a very intense way. And this is exactly what we're trying to do with the photo bus. Why do I stand up here? I stand upon my desk to remind myself that we must constantly look at things in a different way. The project is, com is run by the students. So I am the one who's um, sort of directing uh, the, the, the project, but it's run by the students themselves. So the idea was to, to use photography to bring people together, to really connect people and create real experiences for young people and use photography as a force to unite people and to work on peace. Oh, 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 oh,